Hi everyone, I'm going to show you how to make a little fortune teller joke um, fidget or um, I've heard them called chatterboxes as well. When I was at school we called them fortune tellers but I think a lot of people call them chatterboxes now. So you start off by folding your piece of paper like this because we need to create a perfect square. Then we're going to cut off the extra piece of paper. We can save that for another project and you have a square piece of paper like this. If you already have a piece of paper that's a square, you don't need to do that step. Fold it in half to make a rectangle and then fold it in half again to make a square. Then open it back up. Fold it diagonally to make a triangle and fold it in half to make a smaller triangle. And then open it all back up and then the corners need to be folded into the middle like this and make sure you've got nice crisp folds and do the same with the rest of the corners. If you stop at this stage as well, this is also an easy way of making an envelope. And then make sure they're all folded down, then turn it over and fold all the corners into the middle again. Like so. Fold them as neat as you can. And this is what you're left with. And then I'm going to fold that in half to make a rectangle. And if you push in the middle, and then push the two sides together, it should fold like this. And just give it a pinch at the bottom to make sure it's going to stay in that position. And then you fold the little flaps out, like so. And your chatter box is ready to go. Now you can make these as nice or as mean as you want. And what you normally do is on the outside, you, you'll colour it in or write the colours. So you pick, a, you put colours on the outside for people to pick. I'm just going to do this as quick as an example, but you can make this look as pretty as you want. Then on the inside, in each little triangle, you want to write numbers like so. All the way up to number eight. And then when you open them up, inside would be like the person's fortune or the joke. So you can write nice things like you're kind, you're pretty, uh, that sort of thing. Or you can do um, mean ones like you're ugly, you stink, <laughs> um, you smell. You can make it any way that you want. Um, this one could be um, they're going to get good luck. Uh, just put whatever you want. It could be anything. Could be you're a clown, you smell, uh, you're ugly, um, anything. It depends how mean you want to make it. And just write the fortune or the little um, comment on the inside, like the little prank or anything. Here I'm just trying to think of something to quickly write, so I just put ugly. Then what you do is you fold it all back together, like so. And like that. And then we open up those flap pieces again. And then what you do is you'll say to the person what colour do you want to pick. So say they pick yellow, you go Y, E, L, L, O, W. You ask them to pick a number. So let's say they picked number eight. And you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ask them to pick another number again. So let's say they pick four. One, two, three, four. Then get them to pick the last number, and that's their fortune or their prank. And we picked you smell. Hope you enjoyed the video.